Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Once again, my name is Brandon. I'm an acting and performance coach. And today we're doing something a little bit different. Today, I'm gonna go through this entire list, this long list that was given to me by some serious fans of the band Nightwish. And I'm gonna try to get through the entire list, maybe not in one sitting, but as quickly as I can. So in order to sort of expedite the process and speed this along, you're gonna see this intro, uh, if you watch it on YouTube when it comes out, pretty much in front of every video. When I get done with it, I'm gonna put them all up on YouTube and in, uh, in my membership page. They'll also be available on Patreon. But if you want to see all of them, there'll be a tier available in the membership page for that. And there'll also be a tier where you can catch them about a week before they come out on YouTube one at a time. So we have Nightwish, Everdream. I believe this is live at Vakken as well. I'm excited to jump into it. No idea what to expect. <laughs> Let's just get started. But for now, we're gonna start a little softer. Oh, am I gonna get to hear her sing? Like a, 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 a ballad type? I love their fans so much. Beautiful. A lovely smile. Here it comes. Okay. I I completely heard that coming for the first little movement of the song. Beautiful vocals. They really drew you in, I think, with that. The message was really sweet. I'm interested to see where this goes. No idea yet what the song is actually about. So let's see where this next section takes us. Always epic, always epic. Oh, lovely. Nice. Beautiful. Listen to that vibrato, man. Okay, hold on. Before it goes into the next section here, so it really picked up, ramped up like crazy. Knew it kind of would. I kind of expect it. But what's really cool to me is sometimes in a couple of these, I want to say a couple of the, of the songs that I've heard from them, but in sections of the songs that I've heard from them, the instrumentation, the arrangement, the sort of the energy of the song will just go through the roof. And then they cut to floor as she's delivering her vocals. I mean, she has her moments when she just looks fierce and, and uh, warrior-esque, like really, really ferocious. But there are also times when everything's going crazy everything's on 11 and it cuts to her and she just looks completely in her element completely at peace and it kind of goes back to what i've talked to before about the band and how they always seem to be relaxed and feel comfortable on stage with each other i think there's a lot of trust there's a lot of faith in each other happening out there there's there's a lot of good communication happening it's really impressive we're gonna go back just a hair love love that moment too
like it's nothing. Wow. Okay, so one thing I want to say is I think from him, that's probably the best vocal I've heard from him, in my opinion anyway, of any of the times I've heard him sing. I don't want to say the best vocal. It's the cleanest, uh, most pure sound I think I've ever heard him make. Because he's had some moments in a couple other songs that were really powerful and raw and gritty. That was very clean, very pure, a great sound. I really got to hear his voice in a way that I really don't get to a whole lot. So I really like that. Um, and I just, I can't, I can't, I don't I have anything left. I have no words left to try to explain how floor floors me she just she she just bounds up soars up and hits those notes as as, as easily as as some of us speak it seems so yeah chills all over for this one Okay, we're going to go back and hear that, that note one more time. One of the things I love to see in her as you'll look at her her stance. Sometimes whenever she comes into these moments in the song, you'll see her, her feet spread apart, plants down, nice and firm. Her whole body's engaged, and she's really giving you everything. But this note... I mean, come on. <laughs> really scraping the top up there. That was gorgeous. That was absolutely gorgeous. So that was Ever Dream. I keep getting surprised by these guys. After the couple of songs that I've heard recently, after I mean, my first one was Go Slow Score, and then I think the last one that I did, aside from Romanticide, was uh, The Greatest Show on Earth. And so I saw Ever Dream, I saw the title, and I didn't know what to expect. The simplicity of this, at least from what I was able to gather, just my, from my first time listen, I'm paying attention to a lot of things the first time I watch these, and I don't do any research beforehand. I like it that way. From what I was able to gather from it for my first time listening through it, it was a much more sort of grounded message that was sort of smaller in scope from the the, the the massive scale of something like greatest show on earth and it was really fun it was fun to listen to to this group really kind of hunker down and deliver this this it was a ballad of sorts it wasn't that big epic ghost love score the, the greatest show on earth and i really enjoyed it it was a nice sort of change of pace from the things i've been listening to by them even the romance side was was a lot heavier it didn't feel as weighted so it was nice it had much a much lighter feel to it emotionally so anyway that was that was ever dream night wish and uh yeah let's let's move on to the next one hey everybody how you doing if you're watching this you've made it to the end of yet another possibly the first but probably another one of 16 potential videos maybe more in the future of me reacting to this band back to back thank you so much for watching if you made it this far in the video and you're not subscribed i mean you know like why uh, obviously you enjoy something right so why not hit that subscribe button it really helps out the channel it's probably one of the, the most important things you can do to help this channel grow help it get out to more people uh, just show youtube that you're enjoying what you're watching that let the algorithm know to share it around 
by hitting that subscribe button, clicking the little bell icon, liking the video, leave me a comment, even if it's just an emoji, just slap an emoji down there. It all helps this channel grow. I appreciate it so much. If you want to support the channel even more, there are several ways to do that down in the description. You'll find links to all kinds of things, the Discord, the Patreon channel, uh, YouTube membership is the thing that I'm excited about to give you guys another avenue to support the channel and give me another way to interact with more of you more directly. Yeah. All that being said, I hope you've enjoyed this string of videos. I'm sure that I enjoyed it. And uh, please remember to be kind to each other. And most importantly, be kind to yourself.